My name is Jess and I am the founder and co-owner of Anderson Axolotls and these are my axolotls and we're gonna go through and we're gonna go feed them all. The first two that we're gonna talk about is Parker and Tuplas. Dr. Parker is about a year old. I like 11 months if you wanna be precise. Uh, he's falling off of the hammock. Still falling. Eating and falling. Resting. <laughs> It's too less. Too less. And we got Mr. Toothless, the oldest senior citizen at the park. <laughs> I don't know what, what I'm saying. He is a whopping 11 and a half inches long, a black melanoid, um, but he is does have spots of vitiligo. A vitiligo right there on his back. He also has around his gills, and he is getting a spot on his face. That was aggressive. He looks so fat at his ankle. Look at that. Up on the top here, we have Smoggy. That is one of our wild types. Um, she's actually a rescue. She's trying to eat my finger through the glass. She's very, she gets very excited for food. So we're see, it's very excited for food. Um, and then we have Donut over here, which is our copper leucistic, who we think might actually have some bluegill in her. We're not entirely sure yet, but these are our two females. Are you ready to see a vicious mob? Oh, that made me sad. There you go. Newt, they are our little itty bitty teeny tiny babies. I'm gonna just pull over. Newt, you can do it. Oh, that's so violent. That was very violent worm eating. Now that we've taken a look at all of our personal axolotls here at Anderson Axolittles, that was a mouthful, we're gonna go ahead and take a look at all of our rescues that we have in right now. This is chicken nugget and asparagus. Um, we are gonna do water changes after we do dinner. because That's how I normally do it. Chicken nugget and asparagus have been with us probably the longest besides Smoggy for rescues. Um, chicken nugget is actually going to her new home next weekend. She's the pink albino and asparagus is gonna be going to his new home um, either on Thanksgiving or Christmas. We aren't exactly sure yet. So these guys normally eat anywhere between one to three worms a day. It kind of just depends on how they're feeling. Here we got a banana. Banana is a GFP albino. Um, only have had banana for about a week. Um, banana will eat one, two, sometimes three worms. Banana just eats what banana wants. And she, she also really needs a water change, but we'll do that after, um, after dinner. If you eat that, I will be amazed. I will literally be shocked. If he eats this, we have to record him eating every time because that's the only way he eats. Anyway, so this is Eminem. <laughs> Eminem also came in with us with banana. So they all, the both two of them came in together. We also have a third one that came in with them. Um, Eminem was obviously in a lot worse shape. If he actually eats this worm, I'm going to be floored because the only thing that we've been able to get him to eat is actually, well, he ate a couple worms, but for the most part, he just wants blood worms. He's almost got the whole thing. I am amazed. I think the worm just squirmed into its mouth itself. Remy is also doing really well. Let's see if we can get him to get a good gulp. Yeah, there we go. So he has a taste for blood worms. We haven't really been able to get him to eat much else. Remy is one of my favorites. He has worms sticking out of the back of his gills. It's grossing me out. I'm gonna see if he'll eat it. And lastly, these guys are technically considered home team, but they are also away team. We have Lou and Cole. And these guys are owned by Christina, um, who is the co-owner of Anderson X Littles. 
and her little guys do reside at her in her classroom. She's a teacher during the day. Um, they are, like I said, technically home team, but also a away team. So. So that has been our Meet the Home Team video here at Anderson Axolotls. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Um, we have a Facebook page, a website, all that good stuff that I will link you guys to down below. We did a poll over on Facebook asking if you guys wanted us to make a YouTube channel or do expos in the Illinois area. Well, we are doing both. This is our first YouTube video here on our YouTube channel. We will also be at the Scott Smith's Animal Expo in Wheaton, Illinois, the weekend of November 3rd. Um, we are going to take all of our current inventory that we have for our juveniles that are up for sale on our website. <laughs> He's hiding from the light. Um, so if you guys have kind of been holding back on whether or not you guys want to purchase an axe a little, um, make sure you do so soon because we're gonna take all of our inventory that we have with our juveniles before we take our break for the winter. Um, so make sure you head on over to AndersonAxolittles.com and fill out your purchase. We do ship to all legal states.